Hey everybody, Joe Who Putty Jimbo, Blue Collar Beer Review. One beer, one take, all for y'all. And we're back at it again. And we're not, we're doing a good beer. <laughs> I think we're doing a fabulous beer. This is a celebratory beer, actually. This isn't just some gas station beer. No, 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 not in my house. Well, they do come into my house, as you guys know. But today's not one of those days. Today is, it's, it's a celebration. Celebration! It's St. Arnold's Brewing Company. <laughs> oh, it's my favorite. You know, King Arnold. Well, they call him Saint. I call him King. King Arnold, the patron saint of brewing. Oh, man. I love that guy. And this beer right here is a 25th anniversary Grand Cru. All right? It's, it's St. Arnold's 25th anniversary. They've been knocking beers out for 25 years now. And by far, they're my favorite brewery in the world. The world. Yeah. Everything that comes out of there is fantastic. And I've never had any. And if any of the beers that I've had is any indication of how this beer is going to be, <clears throat> I'm, I'm going to be super honest. I'm already, I'm, I'm wet with anticipation in the mouth. <laughs> and, uh, so let me, let me, uh, uh, there's the intro, Grand Crew. Grand Crew, that name is, the meaning of it is of high quality and is for celebrating. So it makes, it's the 25th anniversary Grand Crew. And this is a blend. It's a triple blend or a quadruple blend. No, it's a triple blend, blend but it's got a quadruple in it. <laughs> All right, you gotta let that bend your brain a little bit. So it's got a Belgian style quadruple ale in it. A, B, it's got a Russian imperial stout in it. And C, it's got an English style uh, barley wine ale in it. And all three of those are barrel aged. And then they mix them all up together, and then they barrel age them some more. And then they put them into this delicious vessel right here. It's almost a holy vessel at this point. It, it, it is! I, I, this is going to be some next level stuff right here. I want to thank my, my brother for bringing this by. He knows what I love, and he wanted me to review this, so... You know who you are? I love you, man. I love all of you, but you get special thanks for bringing me St. Arnold. <laughs> Whoa, this is great. So congrats to, to uh, St. Arnold Brewery. I love you, and I'll pimp for you till the day I die, because your beer rocks. And this is a baby beer. It's a 12-ounce beer. That's it. But big things come in little vessels. And this is a big thing. It's 11.1% alcohol by volume. Perfect. So let's do it. Let's do the double dump. Let's do the look, listen, and smell. And, and, and I'm gonna I'm gonna give you my review. And uh what a great beer. What a just a one up. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. <laughs> no, that's what well, I'm gonna, I'll give it the old real review. So let's crack it. Oh, it's got a little message inside the cap. It says hop on board. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm hopping on board. Oh, this is gonna be great. So. Oh, just to digress for one second, picking up this bottle. I did a review of Miller High Life the other day. It was in a can, and 
one of you guys left me a message and said, you got to drink that in a bottle because that can made it smell like ass. And so I listened to you. I went and got a 12 pack of it, of bottles, because it was on sale and I consumed several of them. And you were right. It's a far better beer in a bottle than in a can. So there you go. I just wanted to get that on the record. And I appreciate the uh, you telling me to uh, go get it in a bottle. And I did that. So thanks for the listener feedback. I appreciate you. But back to this, because this is what's important right now. 25th anniversary, King Arnold. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, ho, 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 ho. lovely, lovely, fantastic color. Dark, look at that, dark, rich, coffee, effervescent. It's, it's gone into the second vessel. This is the secondary vessel, and this is the third vessel. Yes, it's kind of like the Trinity. Boom, 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 boom. You guys know what I'm talking about. This is wonderful, look at that. Look at that color. It's dark, it's rich. Man, I'm telling you, it's like rattlesnakes in there. It's like a, it's like a pit of vipers in there all rattling around. Man, I could put that on a loop and listen to that all day. That sounds wonderful. It definitely smells... The uh, that Russian Imperial Stout is is definitely the the lead smell on this. That it's what it smells like mainly. So that's what you're getting. And I wonder if I'm going to taste that barley or that Belgian style uh, because those are the all three of these beers that they've mixed together are very unique and have a distinct flavor to them, but. Right now, the smell is definitely the uh, Imperial Stout smell. <sighs> strong. The force is strong in this one. I, I almost don't want to drink it. It's, gonna, it's so good. Isn't that weird? God bless you all. Mecca lecca high, mecca hiney, hiney ho. Oh, slow. I just took it slow. Oh, it's got some lace on it. Front of the mouth. I'm getting that. When I started drinking it, it was, it was totally the Imperial style, the Russian. But then when it got back and I started, it started going down I could I could taste that uh, barley wine uh, ale, and when I burped, it, it was it was like a Belgian burp. But in my mouth, mostly it's the imperial. While I was drinking it, I think while it was hitting my taste buds, it was I was getting that barley, and then after I took a breath and burped. It was, uh, you could taste the Belgian in it. So, I mean, what an incredible beer. King Arnold. What do you say? Oh, I know what I say. This is double Jimbo approved. Double. Double. Triple, whatever. 
quadruple. It's quadruple. It's a triple quadruple. A broom. I love this beer. This beer. This beer. Come on. If you can get your hands on one of these, you better. Because this this is next level. This is next level brewing. These guys got it down. They got it down. This is the whip. This is one of the best beers I've ever had in my entire life. I'm not just saying that. Okay. Hey, leave a like, tell a friend. I'll see you around the corner on the other side. Yo, buddy Timbo.